For training programs, meal plans, and coaching, make sure you check out khpfitnessandtraining.com. What's going on, my fitness seekers all over the world? KHP Fitness here with another video for you. On this video, I wanted to talk about my client who's been with me for five months, my buddy Samuel. Now this guy, when he first came to me, wanted to go ahead and lose some weight because he's seen as he was getting older, age started to catch up with him. So as it does, if we're not checking it, age can. Now I'm 36 years old myself, and I have noticed it has to be more and more about the nutrition over time with some resistance training and just watching what you do, man, making better choices as you go. I put together a collage of my buddy Samuel going from the heaviest he's ever been at 240 to coming down to 219. So we got more work to do, but you can see the results and I'll do the side-by-side -side pictures in the midst of that and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. No weights at all. Simple band training. That's what he did this way. Band training, guys. And I told people that band training does work. It is efficient. I have put on muscle on all of my clients with it because the body only knows stimulus. Doesn't know the difference between the weight or if you're using resistance band, it just knows that you have to stimulate it correctly. So without further ado, on to the video clips. Now before I get into that, I wanted to go ahead and get you to hit that like and subscribe button while you're at it to get more views and hit the bell too. All right, starting this off, man, I'm just going through movements, basically what we did here. We did what's called concurrent training. It's a combination of like resistance training days with a style of some kind of cardio based, athletic based training in the midst of it. That's what I did with Samuel, uh, keeping him in a calorie deficit nutrition wise. What I did not do is take things completely away from him. He was still allowed to have his drinks uh, here and there. I just told him he needs to moderate those uh, keeping it for the weekend is not going too crazy. Don't turn it into a cheat day versus a cheat meal. If you're going out with the buddies, you don't have to feel ostracized. And that's the best way to keep a hold on it. Because if you just do chicken, broccoli, rice, chicken, broccoli, rice, and I'm not even vegan, but I'm just giving an example. If you taste, stay super strict all the time, you will cave. Eventually it's going to happen. Some people have really good um, temptation control and some people don't man so you have to work with what works for you so what i do is i see what they like and i try to factor that in you know let them know ask them do they have a little you know little cheat meals here and there that way they don't feel completely restricted and let them know that this is not just to reach a goal but to make a complete lifestyle change now as i said these clips here a lot of upper body work i'm showing here but as you saw we did factor in a lot of the leg work and everything too i didn't include those videos i was looking at some of my old videos trying to archive through but i didn't want to spend too too much time on it but you guys get the gist of it so full body workouts is what we did full body workouts uh some days would consist of since i met with them three days a week is how i do with most of my clients uh it would be two big time big mover hypertrophy days back hamstrings quads chest same way i train and then on the lower days i do uh, biceps triceps shoulders you know just make sure i'm hitting those abdominal work as well and that way you know you get a full body then i would send them some homework to make sure they did that too so that'd be four times a week that i'd be training maybe they don't push as hard when i'm not in front of them but i do check in and make sure they're getting the training when it comes to that because you know just for a time basis I try to manage that and keep accountability on this side when I have them do the homework themselves. That way they can take it into their hands on what they're gonna be doing. That's a huge thing. And if, if people are not doing that with the clients or they're just waiting for you to get back, a lot of times they're probably just taking your money. What my biggest goal with clients as you get better and better at it, you're gonna need me less and less. Some people like my style of training some people like to keep going with me and that's perfectly fine too i'm all about that but the ultimate thing for a trainer a sensei whatever you call it is to make sure that their student gets evolved enough to move on without them and if you're ever afraid to lose a client then you need to rethink training because it's not for you 
and that's it guys i wanted to go ahead and show you that i am so happy for him so looking right here at the side to side results you can see how far he has come within five months because what the nutrition and the resistance training that's what really pushed him over the edge he got disciplined along the way he used to be a big time beer drinker and everything of that nature scaled a lot of that back hit some hiccups in the midst of it but who doesn't which of us don't it took forever for the me to get these guys it took a long time like it's not something that comes overnight but he's only five months into it and this right here is a 12 year process here with myself of up and down yo-yo diet and doing everything I could but whenever whenever I started to you know hone in on getting the nutrition right which was the 80% I believe that's when things really started changing for me so with that being said you guys stay on top of your game we'll talk later it's not where you train it's how you train boom if you're interested in coaching meal plans and training programs make sure you go ahead and check those out i have those for you three four five day splits or more if you need to but don't go too crazy guys as i always say you know unless you're competing or something like that but your body needs rest so if you're getting the nutrition and you're getting everything else with that you're going to get a good combination make sure to like comment subscribe tell your friends share this video and keep watching man because i got more stuff coming for you guys in the near future Thank you again for watching. You guys have a great day. I'll talk to you soon.